Before we get into today's video, I wanted to quickly thank AOA.com for sponsoring this channel. AOA is a great place to buy all of your Rocket League items, including wheels, crates, keys, and much more. Use coupon code JSPADE to save 3% at checkout. Hello YouTube! It is Jack Will Spade. I'm back again with some more Zephyr crates. Um, we've got quite a few that we uh, just got for a pretty good deal, so um, we'll be opening some of those. We actually will be testing Jawbreaker's Crate Theory, the little crate timer that he has. So um, that's currently up. I think we've got about four minutes, so hopefully we can do a quick intro here because I know I've got a lot of stuff to talk about, so we'll be fast. Um, first off, progression update. Um, it is update day and uh, I haven't actually played any games. I just got home from work, but apparently after each game you get experience points and you rank up in a new way that kind of uh, shows you more progression, shows you more active feedback and growth. So that's very cool. Um, I'm definitely going to see what I think about that. We also have these new avatar borders, which are kind of like borders for your gamer pick and um, you can change the color that comes out behind them just kind of like you can do with your uh, banners so um, that's cool I like it when they add new things for sure um, they also fix the issue with uh, the painted mainframes so you'll be able to see that uh, um, this is the pink one I've got on right now and uh, this is the regular so obviously not a huge difference just because pink is not a great color and kind of blends into this purple pink setup I have already but um, I do like how it looks on a purple setup like that. I do like the little lines, the little paths that extend, uh, um, you know, where the lightning bolts go. So that's cool. Um, uh, but it doesn't really work as well on some of the setups I already had, like this. You can kind of see that that pink kind of looks out of place. So um, hopefully I'll be able to get a different color of mainframe, either a purple, crimson, white, black, something like that. So that should be fun. Um, I quickly wanted to talk about something that is kind of a touchy subject, not really sure how to approach it, but long story short, don't get scammed. That's the essence of what I need to talk about here. Um, ever since I started YouTube and even before that, but especially after the Golden Egg videos that kind of brought me more of my subscribers, um, it kind of seems like I am the person to go to when you get scammed or even when you don't get scammed and you're trying to fake something to get free stuff from me. So we'll, we'll address that first. If you are coming to me faking getting scammed to try and get stuff from me, you're not going to get anything. Um, I am pretty good at figuring out whether your story is real or not, and um, I, I just don't give free stuff to you know, liars, people who are trying to, you know, extort others, scam others, like that's just not what I support. So um, please don't waste your time by coming to me pretending that, you know, you pulled five heat waves uh, in a crate, you know, a few days ago and uh, some guy, you know, took them from you and you need me to replace them or something like that. You know, I've heard all sorts of crazy stuff that really doesn't make sense. You know, you, you almost kind of think like, wait, does this person, like, really think that I'm going to believe this story, you know? But um, the, the, it, it, it's also an issue because it takes away from the people who actually did get scammed. So, you know, I start to doubt those other people who have had real issues because of the people who are faking it. So, long story short, just be careful if you're doing a trade over 24 items, um, uh, get a verified middle ban or... Um, split your trade up into segments. Um, I know the last time that I went over 24 items um, was that uh, deal where I sold my white Zombas for white Dracos and 50 golden eggs. And I only did that because we were using Sweaty Finger, the uh, number one verified middleman on the multiverse spreadsheet. And I was in a party with him. He was there with his crew. I could tell he was legit. We were actively talking and his gamer score was correct. You know, I checked his profile and he was the real deal. So it looks like um, our timer uh, is active now. We've got a two minute window to open crates. So I'll go ahead and start that and continue talking. Um, but yeah, in any case, just be careful, you know, people will do all sorts of 
crazy stuff to get your video game items and you know the essence is in order to get scammed you must first put yourself in a situation where there's the possibility of getting scammed you know you have to be in a situation where either you're sending first or you're sending the entire half of your trade while the other person is only sending a portion or you know there's some sort of crazy story about how this guy is gonna give his white zombas to whoever donates the most and of course the other people in the party are just gonna be friends pretending to be strangers stuff like that trying to convince you that it's an actual auction um so you know long story short like you have to put yourself in that situation first to actually be scammed so um obviously i know that there's some people who are either very new to the game or very young in general and um, don't really know how to navigate that and so you know I, I, I'm, I'm not trying to come out and say you know first off black threads that's cool um, we are gonna keep going here just because we only have 30 seconds left on our timer but um, you know I don't want to seem like I'm you know going out to that six-year-old who got scammed and being like hey this is your fault like victim blaming but you know you do have to put yourself in that situation for it to be a possibility so um just be careful be careful of the color switch be careful of people switching white octane for gray octane uh white zombas for gray zombas white draco for gray dracos um any kind of painted vault for regular ones stuff like that um so yeah just be careful it looks like our timer is up now and we've got an eight minute period where we shouldn't open crates so um i'll go ahead and cut to when we're back in i'll see you then all right and we are back it looks like we've got two seconds one second zero seconds so hopefully um this this jawbreaker crate theory can uh, do something for us i think it'd be really cool if it worked out, you know, it could uh, probably... Oh! Whoa! <laughs> Look at that! Purple Cyclone! That is very cool! Um, obviously, that's my favorite color, I think. You know what? I'm, I'm going to continue opening crates just because we have so little time in this window. But um, I think I already had a Purple Cyclone. Um, somebody was... Uh, so somebody had either donated one to me or was talking about donating one to me so and i also know i pulled one myself a while back in a video that i didn't end up posting so um that's very cool I, i'm very happy to get another pur purple cyclone i think that's uh, pretty cool that that happened just as we were talking about like oh i hope this works out um oof we're getting reactors here. Those could have been painted. I did see a little bit of lag. I was, was uh, kind of kind of seeing um, the the RNG think about it for a second there. Um, man, if those had been painted reactors right after the painted cyclone, I think we would have been able to say, you know, this. Oh my God! Oh my God! Is it going to be painted? Please be painted. Please. Oh my God! It is. Wait. Wait, what color is that? That might be purple. Oh my God, guys. Oh my God. It is. It's literally purple. We got our favorite color of mainframe right after talking about it. Oh my God, that is amazing. Obviously, you know, well, I guess we can try. We still got seven seconds left, but that is insane. Oh, wow. Well, I don't know, guys. I do not know. I have never been one to really believe in the whole, like, uh, methods of crate openings, you know? I didn't really think there is any specific way to get something uh, better, but we just got a purple cyclone and a purple mainframe from just a few crates while using this timer thing. So that is pretty insane. Like, no joke, that is crazy. Um, good lord. Well, honest to God, I am very happy at this point. I think that's great. Um, I honestly don't want to be using too many keys just because uh, I am going to California soon and I need to save for that. So we might end it there. But good lord, guys, we got a freaking purple mainframe. 
literally the exact color that I was looking for. Um, that's, that's just amazing. That is so freaking cool. Honest to God, on that setup, I think the uh, pink does work a little better, but I want to see what it looks like on the others, you know? Oh, yeah. That's kind of cool. I can definitely put that on the uh, blue side there. I think um, I'll probably keep the uh, regular for the orange side, but we just pulled a purple mainframe, guys. That's literally the exact color that I was looking for. And I'm not sure how many crates we've opened total here, but it has not been that many. That is crazy. Wow, well, I am so very happy about that. I'm so glad that it worked out, because good lord, you know, that's, that's just great. Well, I do have quite a few trade-ups. Not like a ton, but uh, a, a good few, um, just from um, <clears throat> all of the... Uh, crates that we just opened and there were a few from before that so um, we'll have some trade-ups to do here so we'll go through that real quick but geez I, I still can't believe we just got a purple mainframe using that little timer thing you know that is crazy well may maybe I'm starting to be a believer guys you know maybe I'm starting to believe that is just too freaking good well, I'm happy. I, I don't care what else we get at this point because I got another painted mainframe from just a few crates. That's that's just crazy, you know? Like, obviously we've had two uh, unpainted new black markets, but we've had lime uh, singularity, two black singularities, pink mainframe and purple mainframe. So we're five for seven at this point. And, you know, according to the odds, we should be one or two for seven because there's only a quarter of a chance of it being painted. So that that's just freaking insane. I am so ecstatic about that. Um, I think, oh, this is kind of hard. We'd have to use one more decal. Obviously, we don't want to do our white Chanticos. Um, I think we probably could get rid of the purple Starlighter. That's not a huge deal reds. All right. Well, let's see if uh, our very rare trade-ups have anything for us, but I am already more than happy. I really don't care what happens here. It looks like we do have a couple to do, and those are those black threads, you know? Those are very cool. I'm, I'm happy to have those. Um, I know that people really like uh, black very rare wheels or um, black wheels in general, so um, that's great to have, but please do wish me luck on this very rare trade-up, and we'll do it. Normal Libertines. All right, that's not too bad. Um, well, I mean, honest to God, if you look at it that way, like that's literally the most basic thing you could get. So maybe it is bad, but I'm, I'm in a good mood right now. I don't think I'm gonna be complaining about much. So here goes another one. Virtual Wave, all right. Well, let's see if we uh, have any left. Um, I know we've got a couple unlocked very rares there um i think we would have to well oh wait a second i'm not even see, seeing seeing those dot matrices i was like tripping there all right so we'll go ahead and do that one more very rare normal cyclone okay so no paint on any of those very rare trade-ups but that's fine you know we already got our favorite color of mainframe and our favorite color cyclone and i guess it does look like i already had two but you know a third i certainly won't complain about so that's great um let's see yeah we we, we will have enough for a trade up but it will be on lock for a week um that should be fine though so uh we'll do those guys and i think we'll do that lock cyclone as well so please do wish me luck I am already more than ecstatic getting a purple mainframe and a purple cyclone in the same freaking video, but it would be nice if we could top it off, you know? Still haven't pulled purple reactors, so if that were to happen right here, I would be pretty freaking thrilled. So please do wish me luck, and let's do it. Normals, all right. Well, that's fine. We have still gotten more than enough for this video. I still 
can't believe that we got, you know, our favorite color of mainframe just now. Like, that's, that's crazy, guys. Well, in any case, thank you guys so much for watching. As always, I really do appreciate it. Um, hopefully we can keep this up, you know? I, I've never really been a believer of the crate timer things, but that was a, that was a pretty darn good result. So, um, we might do more of that in the future. Um, I have been trying to do a couple of videos on different types of games. I've been doing a little Bioshock stuff, a little bit of Watchdog stuff, so um, some of that might be up soon. Please do take a look and let me know what you think. And again, if you have an inventory similar to mine and you would like to blind trade, please do hit me up. Um, it would be nice if you could send just a couple little pictures giving me an idea of what your inventory is like. But yeah. I'm happy. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed watching the video, and we'll certainly have more tomorrow, so stay tuned in, and I will catch you all on the next one.